the last part of the uh, lenses and mirrors, the optics unit, is problems with lenses and mirrors. And the first one is called spherical aberration. And aberration means a problem. So spherical aberration happens because rays at the outside of the mirror lens have a different focus than rays near the center. So um, you can see here that the rays hitting the outside uh, focus closer to the lens than ones that hit toward the inside. So you're going to get a blurry image. Um, to fix the problem, you want to use a parabolic mirror lens. Um, if you have a parabola, um, the shape of it, then um, you're going to end up with one nice clean focus and the image won't be blurry. Um, the reason that you might use a spherical lens or mirror is because they are cheaper and a little bit easier to make than a parabolic one. But if you want your lens to be better, you want to use parabolic shape. The second problem is chromatic aberration. Chromo means color, so chromatic aberration literally means color problem. And what's happening there is that different wavelengths, different colors, have different indices of refraction. So they're going to bend at different angles, and the colors spread out, which is dispersion. So if you look at this, the red focus is farther out for this mirror than the blue focus. So you end up seeing like a rainbow haze around your image. And if you are trying to do really um, precise optics, you don't want that to happen. Now, it's only a problem for lenses because the lenses refract. When you're reflecting, you won't see that. Okay, It's all a refraction thing because each different color has um, a different index of refraction. So if this is a problem you want to avoid, you want to use a mirror rather than a lens to form your images. So that's it for the optics unit.